Paris, France, home of the finest restaurants and the greatest chefs in the world. All my life, I've wanted to be one of them. You may think that's a strange dream for a rat, but I've always believed that with hard work and a little luck, it's only a matter of time before I'm discovered. Run! Get them Do you know what would happen if anyone knew we had a rat in our kitchen? Go! Take it away from here, garbage boy! Don't look at me like that! You're the one who was getting fancy with the spices! I need this job. I've lost so many. I don't know how to cook, and now I'm actually talking to a rat as if you... Did you not? You understand me? I can't cook, but you can, right? Look, don't be so modest. You're a rat for Pete's sake. Are you thinking what I'm thinking? We just need to work out a system so that I do what you want. Stop that! Stop what? Stop that! Clicking me off! Ooh. I want to make things, Dad. Stay away from the humans. It's Ooh. dangerous. Ah. Now shut up and eat your garbage. Oh. How did you do that? Just once in the last time. Let's do this thing! Man knows a moment. You gotta taste this! You detect that? An oaky nuttiness? Oh, I'm detecting nuttiness. We hate to be rude, but we're friends. I have a secret. I have a rash. <laughs> you have a rash? He's toying with my mind, taunting me with that rat. Ah! It's getting away! Together, we can be the greatest chef in Paris. Ratatouille? You're in Paris now, baby. My town. Hey. <laughs> The first clause. Oh! Whoa, whoa! You killed him! Did not change the face of the holidays. The second clause proposed a challenge. I've got to get married? I don't think there's a woman out there who doesn't want a piece of this. This time, Christmas is getting Jack. Jack Frost. You are hereby charged with attempting to upstage Santa Claus in a manner that is both willful and malicious. Excuse me. Did you just accuse me of being skillful and delicious? I'm tired of playing second fiddle. I'm going to be Santa Claus. Jack, you gotta let this go. You get TV specials and the postage stamps and the, the army of toy building yes men. What do I get? A few runny noses and some dead citrus. But now, the most powerful clause of all... The escape clause. The escape clause. The escape clause. ...will be triggered. <laughs> sending everyone back in time. Ho, ho, ho. Somebody's on the roof. Hey, you! Oh, 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 oh. Whoa! That coat belongs to me! And it will knock one Santa out. You hit me with a shovel! And let another slip in. You tricked me! You're not Santa anymore. You're just a guy who smells like a cookie. This is so wrong! On Disney DVD. We'll call Christmas Frostmas. The future of the holidays will be at stake. I've done it. What have you done? And the final chapter will begin in the greatest Santa story ever told. I'm gonna make everything good again. Walt Disney Pictures presents... Tim Allen. Give me a status report. Your pants are on fire. Yes, they are. Martin Short. I'm Jack Frost. Okay, okay, chill. I invented chill. Hey, Mom. Santa Claus 3, The Escape Clause. Ho, ho, ho. Everyone on this planet has a dream. The question is how far you're willing to go 
to make it come true. Take Lewis, for example. All right, Lewis, knock him dead. That was a figure of speech. Please don't kill anyone. All his life, Lewis's dream was to find the family he never knew. I know they're out there. But the funny thing about chasing dreams is that no one can do it on their own. What are you doing up here? Desperate times call for desperate measures. And the journey will always take you places you never imagined. What is this? Where are we going? To the future! Let's go! The first visitor to the future. Whoa! will discover a strange new world and a family. Lewis, meet the Robinsons. That's even stranger. Why is your dog wearing glasses? Oh, because his insurance won't pay for contacts. Frogs? Genetically enhanced frogs. And his only way home... I have to find my family. We'll help you, kid. ...is about to be stolen <laughs> by a guy who gives evil a bad name. What the... You are now under my control. I am now under your control. Don't repeat everything I say. You won't repeat everything you say. This may be harder than I thought. I haven't had this much fun. From Walt Disney Pictures... If I had a family, I'd want them to be just like you. You have to go back to your own time. When it comes to adventure... Ah! Dude, I can't take you seriously in that hat. When it comes to family... I think my wife Lucille's baking cookies. Bake them cookies, Lucille! When it comes to comedy... I've got the caffeine patch! You can stay awake for days with no side effects. Ah! Sorry. There's no time like the future. Now my slave, seize the boy! Why aren't you seizing the boy? <laughs> Meet the Robinsons. <laughs> get it off! Get it off! He was left in the wild. He was raised in the jungle. Now, Walt Disney presents the 40th anniversary special edition of The Jungle Book. Yeah, man! The classic story of one boy. Oh, ooby-doo! I want to be like you! So you're the man cub. Crazy. And the friendship that lasted a lifetime. Look for the bare necessities, the simple bare necessities. Beautifully restored with enhanced picture and sound, plus all new bonus features. I like being a bear. That's my boy. Disney's The Jungle Book, the 40th anniversary special edition two-disc DVD. Mowgli is where he belongs now. Autumn 2007, for a limited time. Nothing or nobody is ever going to come between us again. The mission is over. The universe safe. Lilo and Stitch. You have successfully captured all 625 of Jumba's genetic experiments, turned them from bad to good, and found each a place where it can belong. It's time for good friends to say goodbye. You belong out in space. I'll miss you too. Now a new evil experiment will bring them back together. Something masterfully diabolical, hideously ugly, and incredibly stinky. <laughs> I shall name you Leroy! Leroy? You can join the fight for the galaxy in an all-new movie, Leroy <laughs> and Stitch. Now on Disney DVD. 